Hey guys, it's Beth, and welcome back to some more Pokemon Renegade Platinum. Uh, in between episodes, I thought it would be smart- Oh yeah, let's- Let's, uh, bike back and forth through this town, uh, so that we can get Eevee evolved into an Espeon. Turns out, they changed how Espeon evolves. Uh, all evolutions now use stones, uh, not any other requirements. Which, I mean, that's kind of cool, but at the same time, man, uh, I did just waste a lot of time. Uh, yeah. So, I'm going to just quickly, uh, quickly check with every single NPC in case we get any items. Uh, because I know that, um, uh, I know that they do a lot of changes like that in these games, so... <laughs> I just want to make sure that I have everything that I need. Uh, I should probably uh, actually check the PC back in my house as well and see if there's like an item in there. I forget if this is one of the games that has a potion in here. Oh. <laughs> nope, it's uh, just a, just the link to the ROM. Alright. Well, the, the documentation, not the ROM itself. And technically, you only ever get a patch. You don't actually get the ROM itself. Oh, and I just thought about it, uh, I should probably go down and show you all the different specifics about our Pokémon, because we've seen Regal's summary, but we haven't actually seen the summaries of the other Pokémon on our team. So, uh, we should probably do that. I will say, uh, I'm not sure how I want to train up that Eevee. Or if I want to even train it up before evolving it, it might just end up sitting in the box for a bit. Or just sitting in the party at level 5, rather. So, we have Regal, who is level 9, Quiet Nature, with Vital Spirit, Pound, Growl, Bubble, and Water Sport. Roxy is a lax nature, with a Runaway, Tackle, Tail Whip, Bite, and Covet. Mittens is docile, with Keen Eye... Quick Attack, Defense Curl, Foresight, Fury. Fury Swipes, sorry I have the hiccups. Dex is Timid, Speed Up, Attack Down. Keen Eye, Tackle, Sand Attack, and Gust. And Blue is Bold, Defense Up, Attack Down, Keen Eye, Water Gun, Quick Attack, and Growl. So, three Pokemon on my team have Keen Eye, so that's good. They're just making fun of the fact I need to wear glasses is what's happening, actually. My Pokemon are making fun of me. I would say that I'd want most of my team up to, like, level 10 prior to, um, getting to, uh, the next area. Because, uh, Lucas had a level 9, so I'm expecting higher level Pokemon initially off the start. Also, I just remembered I haven't talked to this person right here, so I should probably do that. Right, cool. That's not really useful for me. I already talked to that guy because I thought he would give me a potion. Let's go in here. Oh! Okay, so, uh, nothing here. Huh. Oh! I've been impressed at your ability to- Oh my gosh! What? You can't continuously give me- Tur- Am I getting- Every single fucking starter? You can't be serious. 
Oh my gosh. Nah. No, you can't do that. You you can't be doing this to me. Oh my freaking gosh, hold on. You okay. I will be honest. I don't fully think that it is fair for me to use every single starter. I'm going to be honest. I think that that is pretty cheaty. Um, and I will not be doing it unless... Okay. I'd say... Chimchar and Turtwig are off the table up until uh, we have very, like, no other options, I'd say. Like, I, I don't think that it would be fair to, to do that to us. Because, like, that that's... Wow. Frickin... Uh... Mm, I don't really know what to name you. I mean... I feel like Goku is, like, the, the standard name for these. So I guess I'll put Goku in. Wow. Serious nature, overgrow. Overgrow and blaze. So they don't have the same, like, like, hidden abilities that, um, your starter has. But man, th that's kind of busted. I don't want to have that advantage right off the start. That's, like, th you should only have that as an option after, like, at least the first gem. I don't think that that's fair. Like, seriously. I mean, in any other circumstance, I would absolutely take those, but no, that's... That's, uh, that's crazy. That is absolutely wild. Holy crap. Wow. Oh, Lucas's house, interesting. <laughs> yeah, Pokemon numbers have increased exponentially over the years. Okay. I did talk to this girl off screen, I'm pretty sure. Yep, she's just the one who tells you how to save. Uh, I should probably buy some, like, potions, to be honest. Oh, Pokeballs are cheap. Oh! I already have 10. Let me get, like, a couple of these. I guess five of those. Okay. Uh, hmm. Do I want to grind up my team, or should I just continue on for now? I kind of just feel like continuing on. I feel like we'll be fine. In terms of Pokemon that I want to train up right now, I guess I'm going to put Mittens up front. 
And Roxy will stay in the back of it until we have a, um, a stone for them. After that, I don't know, maybe, I mean, blue or dex we could train up, but I think, I think we're pretty good overall. I know we haven't done much in this episode because we've been just all over the place, but, uh, you know, I want to be thorough for this, you know, I don't want to, like, miss anything important. Especially since these are going to hopefully come out with some delay. I mean, th the first episode and, like, the first week's episode, they're all being recorded, like, a day or two before they go up. Uh, so it won't be impossible to backtrack, but, like, it'll make life a lot more difficult. I might do a bit of grinding for my team off-screen as well, but, like, we'll have to see on that one. I probably will before I fight Barry in this next town. Oh, that's good, they missed Fury Swipes. There's a reason I don't use Fury Swipes, even though it would do more, theoretically. It, that's literally just because it has a low rate of actually hitting. I forget what level Mittens evolves. I should probably actually look that up. Because, uh, I do want that pretty quickly. Uh, level 15! Wow. It shouldn't take long at all, actually. Okay. Good to see. Alright, first battle. Like, first real battle. Last Natalie! Hey! That's awesome. That, that is, like, a very funny coincidence, because my lovely, lovely girlfriend is named Natalie. Oh, and Natalie, in case you're watching, hello, hi love, love you. Because I know you do watch occasionally. You don't have to watch everything, but I'm glad that you watch what you do, since, you know, love you. And I'm appreciative of everyone who watches my videos as well. Since, like, small creator, we gotta, we gotta appreciate everyone. Um, there are some very nice people in the comments. Uh, I guess I'll, I'll swap into Mittens, that way they can get their training in as well. Yeah, most trainers in this game are going to have higher level Pokémon immediately off the start, which is pretty cool. Like, I, I really do love that, actually. I think they did a good job of adjusting the difficulty in uh, in most of the Drayano ROM hacks. It isn't like obscenely difficult, but it's not like terrible. Uh, it's not like that. Uh, all of them ha are a bit of a mixed bag in some regards, but that just kind of happens. Like, naturally. Pokemon is a very hard game to balance because of, you know... It's hard to balance an RPG where you can change your party every 10 seconds. And honestly, that's part of the reason why, um... A way that I enjoy playing Pokemon nowadays is, like, pretty much every gym you want to get a new team. Uh, because, like, the games are actually kind of structured with that, too, because 
You'll notice a lot of the Pokemon you get on early are like the bug types and like Nidoran and stuff, where you can have those fully evolved very early on. Uh, so realistically, it makes a lot of sense to, you know, you make use of those as soon as they evolve, and then as better things come in the future, you, you get new ones and you train those ones up. Of course, there is no wrong way to play Pokemon, and there is no right way to play Pokemon. That's sort of the beauty of it. I feel like I can take out this Starly. Never mind. Let's not do that. Let's, uh, let's actually play it safe. Especially since it has quick attack, so it was definitely going to pull that out on me and try to get the one up on me. Right, we should probably go heal up. Especially early on, it's hard to get, like, super balanced team in Pokémon. Uh, in fact, it's typically better early on to train up, like, two or three Pokémon, and then later on add more in. So, uh, I'd say having, like, the Furret off the start, I, like, what I want to do mainly is train up. I want to get Furret, and I want to get Prinplup, and then I'll probably focus on other things. Oh, hey, a Shinx! And it had Intimidate, dang. I can't switch, though, because I do actually need Mittens to tank Electric-type hits. Wow. Since most of my team is still actually weak to Electric, holy crap, most of my team is very weak to Electric. Since I have, uh... I have Piplup, uh, frickin', uh, Piplup, Sentret, Pidgey, Wingle, and I'm pretty sure I have one more. What am I forgetting? Oh, right, of course, Roxy. Of course, I, I forgot the EV because we're not really going to be able to use them. Hi, Rattata. Right now, I'm going to end up training Mittens primarily on wild Pokémon, since it just makes more sense. Because they'll be able to take on things that are lower level than them, but I don't want to get them trapped in, like, a fight. Okay. Uh, should I heal up before... Eh. I, I feel like it won't be that big of an issue unless they have a Shinx. If they have a Shinx, then I'll heal up and see what I do. Oh, they have three Pokémon. One of which is a Growlithe. Alright, that's fine. Okay, we're going to have to swap, though. So, swap into Regal for a sec. Please do not howl. That is bad. Howl and Leer. That's really not good for me. So hopefully this kills in one hit. Alright, it did. That's good. Min's grew to level 8. Helping hand. Uh, we won't really have a lot of double battle options in this game, so I don't see a really big reason to keep them out. Burmy, I'm going to send in Mittens. I mean, it is a bug type, so I'm not super concerned, but I am just going to heal up. Hopefully it doesn't have, like, bug buds or anything. Hopefully they didn't change the types of these. 
because that might be a bit too difficult. It does have Bug Bite. Okay, so I'm glad I healed. Let's, uh... I feel like Mittens can take on a Burmy. Okay. If they crit, it would be bad, so let's just... Let's just avoid any issues. Okay, yeah, that's why, um... That is exactly why I healed. I'm going to heal again, honestly, because... I'm afraid now. Can we get a crit in return? Nope, okay. Oh, protect, smart. It knew. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't really save you anymore, but that is kind of funny. Wow, that did not really give us much XP at all, huh? Oh, hi, Zigzagoon. on through here, and I think we'll go up to the next town, search around, get a couple things, and I think, uh, we might want to, like, grind up in the next episode. In fact, I can actually say what we should do. We should pick up the fishing rod and get, um, like, get that encounter. Like, the encounters that we can back here, rather. Mittens should be able to beat this in one more hit. Oh no. Oh, please don't tell me. I just... Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That was way too close. I was not okay with what was about to happen there. That was about to be a nightmare. Crits are scary. And this is why I'm like, yeah, we should probably go and, uh, you know, uh, grind up. And I was just thinking, man, we also have a lot of water encounters. We should have probably not picked Pepla. <laughs> That's fine, though. Oh well, I didn't even realize Quick Attack had 30 PP. That's quite a bit. Okay, perfect. Level 9. And an extra potion. That's good, because we just used a whole bunch of them and probably need to buy more. Don't fight me again, please. Oh, okay, that's good. Oh, and here's Lu uh, Looker. I was about to say here's Lucas, but we already know where... Uh, I, I'm just going to, um, I'm going to go just get past Looker 
because, yeah, it's kind of shady. Alright, I'm not going to go into the school at the moment because I would prefer getting some encounters. Let's go do that. So we can get an encounter right here in Route 204. Okay, uh, this is, um... I, I will be honest, uh, Starly is not what I was hoping for. Very much not what I was hoping for. I was hoping I could get, like, a Badoo or something. But, like, I mean... It's not that bad. It's just, like... I would prefer... Getting Pokémon that aren't Flying-type. I mean... I will be honest, getting a Zubat in the next cave, I mean, I'll be pretty cool with that, because Zubat's pretty cool. I don't know why the name Lee just came to me there. Okay, let's just, um, just slowly inch up. Okay. I could have sworn they were about to turn. Oh my gosh. Ugh. Yeah. Why are you calling me weak? I've done nothing to suggest that. That's a Shinx. Okay, I am weak. You're right. I am actually very weak to Shinx. Holy crap. Uh, can I get, like, a Geodude in this next encounter? I kind of need it. Like, seriously, I desperately need things that can take Electric-type hits. So it really sucks that we've gotten a Wingle, a Pidgey, and a Starly. But hey, at least that's most of the birds that we can get, probably. I can't wait until we get Taillo next. I and mean, at least we're getting them out of the way. Getting them out of the way, can't encounter them later. But that is, like, really not great. Nidoran female, okay. Uh, stay in and then swap because we need levels on Mittens, because Mittens kinda has to hold together half the team at the moment. Like, jeez. <laughs> we are very weak to uh, electric type. Which wouldn't be a problem in a game where one of the first Pokemon you get isn't Shanks. But this is the Pokemon game where one of the first Pokemon you get is Shanks, so... That kinda sucks for me. I don't think you have Pursuit, but I am going to Potion up just in case. Because I just thought about that. You know what, actually, might as well just go in with Mittens. Get them as much XP as we can at the moment. Okay. Oh my gosh, that wasn't even enough for a single potion. Oh, that's bad. Like, that's real bad. Alright. This is fine, this is fine. Ok, 
Okay, let's go get the fishing rod. Like, let, let's... Actually, you know what? I'm gonna save the rest of the encounters around here for the next episode. So thank you all so very much for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed. If you did, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more, and I hope to see you all in the next one. Bye-bye!